Hello, welcome to Christ the King's Compline service. This is Friday, June 25th. The opening sentence is found on page 57 in the Book of Common Prayer. The Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord. The maker of heaven and earth. The confession of sin on page 57. Let us humbly confess our sins to Almighty God. Almighty God and Father, we confess to you, to one another, and to the whole company of heaven that we have sinned through our own fault in thought, in word, and deed, and in what we have left undone. For the sake of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy upon us, forgive us our sins, and by the power of your Holy Spirit, Raise us up to serve you in newness of life, to the glory of your name. Amen. Almighty God, grant us forgiveness of all our sins and the grace and comfort of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. On page 58. O oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. We'll now have the scripture reading, and the first of all, we'll have the psalm, and then we'll have the scripture reading. The psalm for tonight is Psalm 31, verses 1 through 6, found on page 59. In you, O Lord, have I put my trust. Let me never be put to confusion. Deliver me in your righteousness. Bow down your ear to me. Make haste to deliver me. And be my strong rock and house of defense. That you may save me. For you are my strong rock and my castle. Be also my guide and lead me for your name's sake. Draw me out of the net that they have laid secretly for me. For you are my strength. Into your hands I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. A reading can be found on page 61 of the Book of Common Prayer. It's Hebrews 13, 20 and 21. Now may the God of peace, who brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus Christ, the great shepherd of the sheep, by the blood of the eternal covenant, equip you with everything good, that you may do his will, working in us that which is pleasing in his sight, through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Into your hands, O Lord, I command my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep me, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. O oh Lord, hear our prayer. And let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Lighten our darkness, we beseech you, O oh Lord, and by your great mercy, defend us from all perils and dangers of this night for the love of your only Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Page 64, the prayer. O oh God, your unfailing providence sustains the world we live in in the life we live, 
watch over those both night and day who work while others sleep and grant that we may never forget that our common life depends upon each other's toil through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. The note is, guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, now let your servant depart in peace according to your word, for my eyes have seen your salvation, which you have prepared before the face of all people, to be a light, to light in the Gentiles, and to be the glory of your people Israel. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The almighty and merciful Lord, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit bless us and keep us this night and evermore. Amen. <laughs>